shit is blowing me. Like, it's getting on my nerve. Like, I don't know about y'all, but like. channel i'm kind of in a rush right now but welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome back um today i have on all white because it's a really special day for me but before i tell y'all why make sure you like comment and subscribe hit that notification bell so you can know every time i post today is my great grandmother's birthday she passed away in 2020 during the pandemic it was a very very hard time for me and my family so today i want to release balloons for her but before that i have some important running arounds to do and then i'm going to do a balloon let go for her with my daughter so i'm going to see you guys in a few guys so i'm outside right now um i had kind of a rough day but like my family my loved ones down to even my ex-boyfriend talked to me and made me feel better and i feel happy and i feel like my grandmother's in a better place so i'm gonna let a couple balloons go for her and kayla's gonna let some go too but i'm gonna do what i'm gonna do mine's oh. first and then she's gonna do hers it looks so pretty now the ends are stuck together amazing this is amazing it looks so cute today. Does that look so cute? Yes. Okay, so they're actually stuck together. So, take it, you could just, I'm gonna let them go for all of us because. Well, I know how to. Um, I just wanna say happy birthday, Coco Mama. I love you so much. I never stop thinking about you. I will never forget our memories. I will never forget you. I will always remember you. I will always love you. Happy birthday in heaven. Yay. Your turn, KK. Yay. I really love you, Coco Mama, and I hope you're really good, and I know you're really good, and I never thought to thinking about you, too. We love you. Bye. Happy birthday, Coco Mama. What's up, y'all? I'm doing laundry right now and eating food from yesterday that I cooked. I fake wanna pour the whole thing in here, like. I make my laundry real fresh. But yeah, y'all. I'm miserable. Niggas is getting on my motherfucking nerves, per usual. Like, spend some money, like, spend a real check. And stop talking my fucking head off. Guys, I want to tell y'all some shit, but I'm not even going to tell y'all. Like, I'm going to just wait because I don't need y'all judging me. But comment, comment on this video if y'all remember when I was talking to, um, my ex with the big chain. Remember, I used to always be wearing that big chain in my vlogs. Not always, but like, y'all know what I'm talking about. Let me know if y'all remember that. If y'all remember that, then I'm gonna tell y'all the tea the next vlog. I always wash my clothes with cold ass water. I'm, I'm tired. Like, I'm so tired of everything and everybody. Like, then I'm on my weight gain journey again. I'm looking fat as fuck. My tummy is puffing out. Look at my booty though. Y'all probably can't even see it. But yeah. Let me know if y'all remember my ex with the chain. The big one. I think I have a vlog with like. I was brushing my teeth in it or some shit like that. Let me know. Let me know. I'm cleaning up the house right now. I don't know what's on my agenda for today. I probably go out to eat for the 100 million time. But I really want a nigga to really like take me to Gucci or Louis or take me to the jeweler or throw something on my throw something on my ticket. Like tired. 
tired of going out to eat. Like, that shit is blowing me. Like, it's getting on my nerve. Like, I don't know about y'all, but, like, I don't want to go out to eat a hundred million times. Like, I want to go to Louis, Gucci, Saks Fifth Avenue. Like, certain shit is up my speed. Like, this, bro, this is why I just stay to myself. Because I don't have to talk with myself. I just go to the store and buy it for myself. Like, What's up, y'all? It's the next day. Um, this vlog is like me pretty much on the go. This week for me is really about self elevation and self care. Um, I'm proud to say that I just got approved for a credit card. Um, my credit was amazing last year, and it has not been so amazing this year. So I just did what I had to do to jump my score a little bit. So that's one thing that I'm happy about. I don't like talking about things that are official. It's official. We here, we live, whatever. Um, today, I've been suffering from scoliosis for all my life. After I had my daughter, I started experiencing lots of pain. And massages really don't help. Well, maybe because I'm not getting professional massages. They really have not been helping me. You know what I'm saying? So today I'm going to the joint chiropractor and they're going to crack my bag. This is the first time I'm doing something like this. And I just want to feel better. I want to look better. I want to feel better. Um, I want to start stretching every day. I want to start doing push-ups push to build upper body strength. Like I want to really like take care of myself. And as y'all know, I'm doing my weight gain again because that's another surprise. But I'm doing my weight gain again. So... I really got to be on top of myself. Um, this Uber's taking so long, which is really, really getting on my nerve right now. But I'm going to show y'all little b-rolls of what I can when I get there. I'm by myself, so I don't think I'm be able to show y'all and crack my back. But I'm going to definitely, definitely let y'all know how was my experience. Was it clean? Which one I went to? Et cetera, et cetera. No. Look at this crazy girl. Hi, water rat. She called me a water rat earlier, so. Guys, it's okay. the next day. I'm going to the grocery store. Um yeah i forgot to tell y'all how the therapy session went with the chiropractor it was actually pretty good um i really enjoyed it he cracked my back i'm going back tomorrow actually because i'm going to be going two to three times a week for the first two weeks because i've been feeling this pain since i had kayla i always had scoliosis but after i had the baby it was like really really bad like i was in constant pain in my back so he told me that yeah, whatever. I was in constant pain um, for years, you know, and I was getting massages thinking like the massages would help because I was like, oh, maybe I'm tense. But no, I'm actually in pain because I have a freaking problem. And he said that my hips were pushed up like this and he's trying to like realign them. So I want to do my, um, I want to really get into this chiropractor thing. A lot of people from research said that chiropractors do not help people with scoliosis and etc and etc but i also want to do yoga as well because my curve is very very minor like it's very small so i'm like i want to like do yoga and i want to do like a daily scoliosis stretch to like not live my life in pain and if my curve like if it doesn't improve by like this year i might do the surgery but i don't feel like that's necessary for my curve like literally every doctor i ever went to said it's so minor no one cares it's not a big deal we are looking for the cajun spice no that's the paprika oh found it let me push them up so other people don't have this problem and i want to get a pound cake yeah are back from Walmart mm -hmm. um as y'all can see I got my waist trainer on I want to start waist training again just to keep me right because I am on my weight gain journey again which is why I'm at the grocery store every week now because what I could eat for two weeks I am eating all my food in a month 
So, I mean, in a week. So, I have to constantly go to the grocery store. Um, I got a lot of food. I already put them away because who the hell wants to put that? I got some butter and got some strawberries. Like, nobody wants to deal with that. Unless I'm trying a new product out to eat. I feel like it's unnecessary. Let me show you guys the new product I did get. These are the only two new things that I got. Um, this is a dishwashing soap. Okay. And this is a universe cleaner so like an all-purpose cleaner um i want to step up the aesthetics because i can't like the way i want to talk to y'all i can't even really put y'all on right now but just know i'm stepping up the aesthetics okay oh it smells so good like it doesn't smell like the basic it smells really good and also guys i want to start using my dishwasher so please comment below soaps that y'all put in y'all dishwasher so i can have an idea of what i want i like scents that i like good scents like the game scents stuff like that mm, this smells so good too like this doesn't smell all producty and that doesn't even make any sense this doesn't smell like regular cleaning supplies like that cleaning scent like this just smells good like this smells good it smells like it's uh, fancy and i like it i like everything fancy i like good aesthetics it's aesthetically pleasing i do wish that it was pink but it's not it's fine so yeah today i'm cooking a big dinner i'm making fried fish mac and cheese for the first time with candy yams also for the first time like all of these can i cook today all for the first time i'm not dropping a vlog today it's sunday i usually drop my vlogs on sunday i'm gonna do a tiktok to run you guys through my sunday but by this time, that TikTok will already be out. Um, so yeah, let me get started cooking everything like that. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked it. And by the way, just got in town. And I won't let you in this cloud. It's all in the sky. Ruin my vibe. Guys, I burnt my mac and cheese. I'm pissed. But oh my god, everything is so freaking good. Be careful before you hit your face. I'm not. Ready for my dance? Mm hmm. Ready? I did it wrong. Hold on, let me do it one more time. Ready? Mm hmm. <laughs> guys they wanted me to do a tiktok what's in my bag so i'm gonna do that before i go get something to eat tomorrow is a really important day for me because i'm covering my ratchet tat on my back i'm gonna show y'all the before and after but i did want to do a little um what's in my bag with y'all real quick i thought i was recording but i wasn't i was like recording the opposite way so I keep some ones just in case I see some strippers because I love strippers. But this is my money from work that I forgot to change. <laughs> um, my Chanel wallet. Um, some slips from the bank deposited in my beans. And some big bills and my lip gloss oh my god my bag fell my keys to my house and some rubber bands for my bands and what else i got in here the cards from my chiropractor to get my back cracked or whatever i'm also doing a tiktok of this um, right now, I might go get some food. I don't know yet, but I'm just preparing for tomorrow because tomorrow I'm getting a tattoo, a cover-up. It's a really important day for me. I'm really excited. I got this messed up ghetto ratchet tattoo when I was 15, trying to be grown. And today, well, tomorrow, I'm covering it. And this is my first tattoo in Florida, so I'm really excited about that. And I cannot wait to show y'all how this tattoo is about to turn out. I'm at the tattoo shop. Um... I'm going to give you guys a little tour after this. I'm getting my mermaid tattoo cover up. 
Um, when I was 15, I got a tattoo of my daughter's name. The tattoo artist made an error with, within him tattooing it on me. He almost spelled her name wrong and he caught it. So it looks really funny. I'm going to show you guys the before and after. And let me show you guys the blueprint of the tattoo I'm getting today. This is my my new tattoo artist. Say hi. Hey, how you doing? But yeah, guys, this is the sketch of it. Yeah. I'm in Little Haiti. I got my tattoo. Um, I watched a lot of YouTube videos about Little Haiti, and they were saying it's dangerous. They will snatch your purse and kill you. And I'm just like, it don't even seem like nothing goes on over here. But maybe because it's daytime, I'm seeing like a lot of so mommies and so poppies. I just left the tattoo shop it was so fun he was so nice and kind to me the whole time i used numbing cream he had the numbing cream already usually you had to order it but he already had it so my tattoo was like on the pain side it was like a six Nah, it was like really a five mm. yeah it was like a five out of ten and now i'm about to get some food and i'm gonna talk to you guys when i get inside <laughs> Guys, I look ugly because I was not home. But um, I'm bringing Kayla's teacher a present. I promised Kayla that I was coming to bring this gift because she really wanted to get her teacher a gift. So I'm at her school. Guys, I'm at Kayla's school right now. Say hi. That's rude. Say hi, guys. Look how she look. Look at her little outfit, y'all. She's a little raggedy right now, but I wanted to come stop by her school before I go to brunch. Say bye, guys. It's a little bit of a mess on the paper. But um, today I went to Target. I got this cute ass robe. Oh my god, it feels so good. I really wanted a robe. I want a white one and I want to get a gray one. Um, I want to stuff up the, oh my god, it looks like such a mess. Let me clean up. Anyway, went to Target. I was getting Kayla's teacher like a gift. Wait, I want that sound off. Okay, great. I went to Target. I was getting Kayla's teacher like a gift or whatever. Seen a robe, loved it. I wanted to get patches for under my eyes and I want to do some intense exfoliating to my face but I left my products at my house and I forgot to get the eye patches at Target. Um, I have so many beauty products I got to re-up on because I want my nice flawless skin to stay the way it is. Um, I don't really got much to do this week left. So I'm gonna end the vlog off here. Um, I, I know y'all was complaining about the vlogs being 10 minutes, 13 minutes. So this is something a little longer for you guys. Guys, I had to randomly enter this clip because right when I closed out the vlog, I remembered that I got this candle from Target. I showed y'all my candles last week 
and they were from Bath and Body Works. That's where I usually get my candles from because I don't feel like other candles are really effective. The ones that I tried at Walmart, Target. Well, I haven't tried a Target candle, but Dollar Tree, Walmart, the candles are not as effective, or maybe I'm getting the wrong brands. But, but this is from Target, and it says Plant Wax Blend. And it's a Magnolia Blooms in Apricot. Let me show you how it looks. This is what it looks like. And it comes with like a little. So, it smells good. And I'm gonna like light it up in a small area, see like how it smells. Cause I didn't wanna get the big one. And this was about, I think five or $10. I didn't wanna get the big one until I knew like, this is effective. But it smells really good. It smells like my Dove exfoliating scrub. It has a cute smell. But yeah, that's what I got today besides my cute ass robe. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I'm tired, I'm getting ready to like figure out what I'm gonna eat and that type of stuff. Let me know if you guys are feeling the highlights. I'm about to get this hair um, refreshed, like the edges done over. And I wanna get my hair wand or I wanna get bombshell curls because I really am loving the highlights. I'm just loving the light look instead of the dark, dark hair that I normally have. And um, yeah, y'all, like I'm tired. I'm ready to just go to bed, eat, call it a night. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new here, welcome to the family. I hope you subscribe, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn that notification bell on. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one. Love you, doggy.